Hello everybody, welcome back to more Astro Narc. Bop. We will put the brawler in and we shall win this run. I uh, oh, I will I'll die trying. I mean one of the two. <laughs> Probably that one. We'll see. I think that we need ourselves a nice and valid other tank or the outlaw. We've used the outlaw too much. Uh, let's go with, let's see. We got the Juggernaut. We got the Gladiator. The Gladiator gets buffed up over time. First time you're reduced below 50% max HP. Increase your tank defense by 20 and heal. You know what? Let's do it. There we go. We got that. What else do we have? I mean, we could get the Wild Mage and try to finally do Wild Burst. That could be interesting. Uh, we could do, we could finally get an assassin up in there, but I feel like that should maybe be reserved for now. Let's do that. It's reserved for right now. So what do we need? Defeat a boss with one here remaining or, I mean, we'll see. I'm not going to like, I'm not going to make that happen. If it happens, it happens. Defeat all three elites during a single act. I will definitely try and do that. Uh, sell an ability orb and two potions. I don't know if I'm going to do that. <laughs> Equip three of the same item if it, if it... The opportunity presents itself, sure, sell 10 potions. I feel like there's no point in doing the druids one because we're probably just going to unlock it by defeating Corruption 3 before we do that. And defeat an act after visiting seven events. That seems like uh, one that will mess us up pretty uh, pretty bad. I'm going to go with the tag here. I'm going to uh, go with the tag there. We'll definitely want to hit. We can't, we can't fight all the elites in here, so we should not even consider it. Um, the good news here is we don't really care about healing reduction. I, like, it affects Rampage a little bit, I guess. Sure. Alright, so. What do you do again? It's been a while there, Mr. Assassin. I mean, we I know we had you, but. Gain hidden, your attacks poison your target, dealing 10% attack damage every 3 seconds. You target the back row first while in the front row. Yeah, I, cool. I'm into it. I would, uh, I would definitely like to prioritize picking up... This is... A little spooky here. A little spooky, sis. Ah! <laughs> oh, boy. Okay. 50 HP and bonus speed. Immunity to burn. Okay, so... That. I really, really like the idea of getting this upgraded to... Um, negate. Bleed. And then picking up that other thing that lets us be immune to... Wait, no. Converts our damage that we take into bleed. Because then we can effectively, if we get them both maxed up, this to rank 2 and that other thing to rank... Or this to rank 1 and the other thing to rank 2, we could make it so we effectively just take 50% less damage on that character. Uh, I mean, get the vine at the start of combat? I mean, we could. I feel like Arcane Stabilizer is a good call, though. We really do, since we don't have any support characters, we're going to need to make sure that we are really doing a good job. This is a, a wild one. 7% chance to deal an additional 300% piercing. So the brawler, who's who's attacking faster? The assassin by a lot. So if you attack more often, it's more likely that you will actually proc it. But when you proc it, it'll be bigger. I'm going to go for that for now. I will also want to... Increases attack speed. Gain a special item, lose half your morale. Gain a special item, random here, loses five attack, five defense. Sure. Ladies and gentlemen, there it is. Okay. So I would like to go down there, go to the shop, upgrade this to ignore bleed. Oh, this is grim, but... Get this so that we ignore bleed. And then, baby, we got a stew going. We are attacking the back line first. Maybe we should move you to the uh, the back so we actually split it up. Yeah, no, this is actually really good. That's proving to be really, really good. Um, you attack, target is defeated. Gain 10 attack and 10% speed. I definitely don't hate that. Uh, I wish it was like a smaller, like maybe a little smaller buff, but it was permanent. I think that would be kind of fun. Um, I want to live. 
I want to live. We got holy water. That's fantastic. Okay. You do adjacent. We really, that's a nice benefit is that it genuinely does not matter if we have anybody adjacent, right? It's a little sketchy. But I do like that we're going to be single target attacking here. All of our damage should be going on this son of a gun right here. We're going to be getting in a little bit of spooky territory, but we're negating there. Yeah, he's going down. That's fine. I kind of anticipated as much. Uh, okay. Healing received is increased is definitely an interesting concept for the future. It does not matter right now. Every five times you attack, gain and negate. I'm going to get the Impaler. I, wanna, I just want to make sure the poison that we're stacking does a good amount of damage. I am actually quite mad that this is the case because now I feel like I have to sell this. Okay, so, we are now immune to bleed, which means 30% of the damage we take never happens. So this is theoretically amazing. This guy does not care about adjacent, does he? Oh, he does. He does care about adjacent. He cares very much about adjacent. Poison your target and an adjacent enemy. Okay. Okay. Reduce the speed of enemies' hits. I mean, you know, there's not much we can change here, but in theory, we should have hit, like, a really big power spike. And the damage we take should be really not that bad. Theoretically. This all being said, I almost wonder if we could get away with putting this on the brawler, too. I, be I bet you we could. Yeah, we're, uh... We're, we're, we're living. For every 50 MP you spend, heal the weakest hero for 100 HP. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's try that out. So, for active ability, Garote, we could... That makes it so it does 300% attack damage. We could get stun. Which makes it do 400% attack damage, but it's not... We're not really putting attack damage on him. The only person who's kind of utilizing that, the stat... Of their active ability is the assassin. Same story as before. Do we want to attack the backline first? He doesn't have very much HP. He has allies for one percent. I think this. I think that's a good call. We need that guy dead. Allies gain shield equal to ten percent of the max HP. The bleed will go through that. This is spooky. Don't get me wrong. But he is... He is a tanky son of a gun. He is a tanky son of a gun. Good. Your tanks increase your defense by two. First time you're reduced below 35% max HP. Redirect one random enemy targeting you to their next target. Yes. I think that we want to take the Ascension Cloak. Drop it on you. I... I oh. I wish I had enough money. Is there another shop coming up? There is. So does this... This does not cleanse us. That is something important to think about. Something very important to think about. But we're, we're splitting up this damage here. We'll get down to 35. We'll switch it so he's going to be targeting up there now. Interesting. Maybe, maybe we swap these entirely now. Hmm. Okay. Okay. 35%. Tower. Sh we could get rid of the tower shield. Max HP. I don't know. I mean, because this character does perform better with higher HP, theoretically. I I don't know. I'm, I'm feeling a little weird about that. But so he does not care about adjacency. None of that. 
None of that. So this is the ideal. We'll, we'll get to you. He'll attack. He'll attack him down to 35%. Then he'll swap over to the Juggernaut. Who will actually take... Why are you healing? Because of the Brain Sage. Okay. So you're Ascension Cloak. So now you're targeting him. Who would then go down to 35 and gain a shield. All right. All right. This is feeling pretty smooth. Feeling pretty smooth, if you ask me. So for the passive, this is where it gets a little bit goofy. Because everybody's passive. I, I would enjoy everybody's passive being ranked up. Mm-hmm. All right. All right. Normal battle. Let's get it. Give me that money. Give me that money, honey. Adjacent? Yeah. The burn wears off. So, well, no, this is, that was bad. That was not a good call. The cast will start healing just like a little bit there. It's enough to be worthwhile, certainly. And then applies it again. Okay, this is kind of this is kind of working. Immunity to disarm. This stuff is not really wowing me. I'm thinking of maybe going for the Man of Spring amulet. Maybe not. I don't I don't know. I'm going to get this because I can't remember how it upgrades. I'm probably not going to upgrade it, but I'm I'm I'll admit I'm curious. Disarm and stuns. All right. Well, the the logical thing to do is to upgrade vampire guard because that's an extra 10% damage reduction forever. It's kind of huge, you know. It's 25. That's 20. I'm going to be crazy. I'm going to be crazy. Doom is the other thing. All right. So, boom. All right. So, this the Juggernaut takes 50% less damage. Just that is what that item does for us. All heroes bleed uncontrollably. Next combat. All heroes have reduced healing. Next combat. I, I, if we lose, we lose forever so i'm not gonna risk it since the next combat's the boss that's a i think we can handle it genuinely just fine but i ain't gonna i ain't gonna mess with it you know all right so this should in theory i should have definitely swapped those this should in theory not matter anyways that's him taking 50 percent less damage eh okay he's healing over time it does make him the recipient of Brain Sage, though. So that's really important to think about. Got that ability cast. For every... Okay. This is going weird, I'll tell you that much. This poison should be stacking up pretty well. Oh. I thought that... There would be it. Well, okay. I thought he split into a bay bay. God, I wish that this applied the passive of the assassin. Let me think. Wait, I just realized reduces the speed of all other heroes and enemies. So that does that means it does not reduce the speed on the one that it's on. That's that's very interesting. Let's try that out there. Okay. Oh, I'm certainly confused. 
Da -da -da. Ba da ba ba da ba da ba ba da ba 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 da ba 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 I think that probably getting a like a support character is a good call, right? And the alchemist is a support character that's like half a support character who can really effectively use attack damage which seems to maybe be what we're going for here healing received by all heroes is increased by 20 percent is is tempting ah it's tempting we obviously don't have a ton so it's not like amazing All right, so. Okay, all right, what do we want to, what's your tag damage, 61. It's good enough, honestly. Attack speed, two, well, that's pretty bad. Okay. So it's good to be splitting that there. I think we just, just rock it, right? Rock it. All right. All right. Ascension Cloak, you're taking all of it now. Healing pretty decent. Healing really quite decent. The star does help us with that. Oh, boy. Why have you done this? Can't believe you've done this. Okay. Bleed you dry. I mean, I'm, you know, bleed you dry. If they're bleeding the target, this is actually super ideal. Uh oh. Okie dokie. What could possibly go wrong? What could possibly go wrong? Whoa. Uh oh. Yeah. As I was going to say. Wait. No, he does the random damage. It's all fine. It's all fine. <laughs> uh, <laughs> what if... Could you imagine? What if? We'll, we'll give it a shot. We will give it a shot. I, I think that that could be kind of fun. Okay. Adjacency doesn't really matter here. Oh, wait. Oh, shoot. Oh, wait. So he's hidden. So this actually should be perfect. All right. This is this is this very janky thing should be right. I think. Oh, we got moved. The good news is... Question mark. Um, let's see. What is the good news? That we won. <laughs> That's what the good news is. Okay. So, we have 20% speed. Your attacks have a 40% chance to stun your target. Certainly a tempting proposition... We're definitely going to take one of these two. Ten attack. That should bump it up to six damage, I would imagine. Weird. Weird. Weird choices. Weird choices, I'm aware. All right. Uh... Do we want to target the backline first? 
I don't know that we do. I think we want the front line as dead as possible. Anything adjacent? I can't recall. Disarm your target. We had the thing that made us immune to disarm, but I think we got rid of it. All right. Disarm your target. Oh, I mean, yeah. Okay. All right. I think that's the ideal there. But yeah, we want all of the damage to be done on this guy instead of splitting it with the back line because we need we want him dead so that we stop taking damage from him. It's as simple as that. And you are, yeah, you're getting that big old heal from your huge chunky passive there. Life is looking pretty decent, if you ask me. Mm -hmm. Okay, this is weird now. Do we get another arcane stabilizer? Wait a minute. Hey, we unlocked the illusionist. Hey, hey, hey. Okay, did we put everything back right? We did. Okay, I want a merchant. Yes, please. The hell do we do? Upgrade. Okay, so 200 HP. Uh, plus 200 HP. Yeah, I mean, it's super tempting. And heal for the same amount. Redirect two random enemies targeting you to the next target. Ah! Yes, we should do that. <laughs> I did not even process the fact that that was not happening. I was thinking because the outlaw. All right. Plus four defense forever. I'm not going to complain about that. Hold on. Is the... Uh... Ah, shoot. The elites are in a spot where I can't possibly fight them all again. Again. Sell that. Can we get up to... Uh, yeah, we'd have to sell too much stuff. Anything, like, really worth having here? Another brain... Another ascension cloak is genuinely an interesting idea for... I don't know. Like a third off tank. <laughs> it's weird, but... It's weird, but it could work. Grave Digger! Assassin is... So screwed... We just I think we just accept that the assassin's going to die. Oh, first attack might be the alchemist though. Nice, 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 please. Nice, good. Cause we can now it's gonna swap to the assassin while the alchemist heals up. Alright. Alchemist or assassin. Oh Did he have a shield or something? Or did he have damage reduction? He had a uh, the defense, I guess. I mean somebody's gonna die right now. But honestly, that is Clean stuff. Clean enough. Clean stuff. Clean enough. All right. That's a maybe. Do do do. Dow dow. Do do do. Yaha. Da da ba. Did do. -do, -do. I just, I don't know. I'm, I'm kind of trying to think of who, who else we're going to get. I'm going to get the Rod of Cast thing. Hold on to it for a bit, I guess. That's pretty important to me. Ah, Mama Rat. Want you here so you're always attacking that back line because we are going to get doomed. Okay. 
This is this is right there. I think we, we've actually we've got this totally good due to the fact that the fact that we can hit the back line is amazing. Um the whoever you're targeting right now is going to die. No? Piercing damage equals your target's HP. What? Why didn't that... I mean, I'm fine. I'm very fine. Don't get me wrong. I'm super pleased. But why didn't that kill me? Take the money. Yeah. Duplicate nine, nine now. So. All right. All right. Well, hello, boys. Uh, deal damage to your target. Stun any adjacent enemies. Deal blunt damage to your target and apply ruin. Okay. Your target changes their target to you. I mean, it already is, but okay. All right there, mister. I think we should be fine. Oof. Yeah. This is a uh, this team is feeling clean. I will take the hero's sigil and think about it. <laughs> I will pick that up and I will think about it. Oh, it's so tempting. Witch's stick. This is a rare now. Starting MP attack up. Your attack steal one MP from your target. And it is also, yeah, it's also unique now. Lover's safeguard has been changed as well. When you have one or less adjacent ally, you and an adjacent ally gain 12, 12 shield per second. It's super, it's super interesting now. Um, this all being said, I, I just want to upgrade something. Because I really feel like that's the thing to do. Forty six damage to all enemies. 90% chance to apply frost. Ignore doom is very tempting. Boy. We'll upgrade one of those. We can always switch it to being on the other guy instead. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with that. Ah. I see. So we're all going to be stunned no matter what, huh? Yeah, this is just this is just a it's just a rough little thing. Might as well have them split up in half so we get stunned half as much instead of all of the time. But this is really gonna be quite annoying. Incoming yep. Incoming malarkey. If we do not Yeah. I did we need to cast that? I'm not so sure. When you heal a hero by any means, a random damaged hero is additionally healed for 30% of the value. Does, I mean, the... See, the alchemist is technically not healing. Is that because they died? I don't know. Oh, that's so weird. I don't know. I like the idea of it, but I don't think it's really what we need right now. High Elf Claymore. If it was upgraded, I would take it. If it was upgraded, I would take it. Since it's not, I shall not. Oh, God. The fact that these are together means we kind of need to have two people up there again. It's 
So yeah, when you go below 35%, it's going to redirect to the same person in here. But since it's the assassin, they're hidden. It's going to go up there. All right. Okay. I just have... I have concerns about this fight. Yeah. Clearly, logically so. Feels a little like... Potentially overtuned. But... You know, tis with tis. We're doing all right. That frost let us get in some really good starts there. We're all good. We're all good. Yikes, though. We're all good, but yikes, though. Just keep taking the money. Ooh, boy. It's another rough fight for sure. Anything with adjacency? I don't remember. No. Okay. Do 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 da da. Big old shield for everyone. And it's not that it's not that big old, but still. How much are we honestly healing? Oh god. Please switch your target. Have you not switched your target? You did. Okay, good. Disarm, that's fine, I understand. We're doing okay, we're doing okay, we're doing okay. All is all is well in the world. We're fine. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Ah, okay. Absolutely. Okay, well, we'll go to the fight. We'll, we'll figure it out now after this. I feel like over the... Oh, no. No. These guys suck. Oh, God. This is bad. They, they are, we're using both of our potions against them. Okay, step one, where's the claymore going? Does anybody get shields? Nobody gets shields. Okay. Second of all, we're gonna be splitting up and it's gonna be going on longer anyways, so. If you have no allies, yeah, whatever. Your target changed randomly after each attack. If you have no allies, your attacks cause bleed. Yeah, 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 yeah. You will always target the enemy with the highest HP. It's going to be... Oh, it's split. Huh. Uh, well, it's the highest current HP, I think. I don't know, man. I don't know. Trying to figure out who to focus down first here. Target changed randomly after each tag. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, we can't really. We obviously want to make it so we uh, uh just moving them away from their adjacent allies i mean i think we can do something like anyone else care about adjacent if you have no allies no allies uh no nope nope I don't know, man. I think we just have to click it and hope. We just have to click it and hope. Hopefully that that 
Oh, that initial burn. That initial burn is doing a lot. So the cloak hopefully should have fixed that there. You are going to go down, which is fine. I hope that you just can stay alive right now with the healing. We're, we're going to be fine. We're going to be fine still. This fight is so scary all the time, but we're going to be fine. It's fine. None of this matters. This guy's the least of the concerns when he's alone. Oh, boy. I feel like the Headdress of Fury is an interesting thing we could do. The Crown of the Banshees, maybe. All right. Well, we're alive. Barely. So we unlocked a character. I kind of, yeah, I kind of want to save them for the next episode and, like, really, really make them the focus of the next episode, though. I'll take a look at it. When attack, you have a 10% chance to teleport to another location and increase a duplicate of yourself. With attack and max HP, uh, fractions of, base, oh, 100% attack and a 25% max HP. Duplicate does not attack and deals 200% damage to the attacker when destroyed. Mirror image create a duplicate for the rest of combat with 30% of your max HP, attack, and defense. Your du duplicates do not have items or abilities. Strange. It might be kind of more fun. What if... Uh, wouldn't it be a little bit more fun if the mirror image was really, really weak, but it did have, you know, like, but it duplicated, like, your top item or something like that? That would be really fun. That'd be a really cool idea, huh? Because kind of going with the, um, the nature of how you unlock this character, wouldn't it be kind of fun? Maybe, maybe it is that way, or maybe at max rank. That'd be interesting, where it's a really weak character, or a really weak image, but it does use your top, like, whatever item is in your top slot. That'd be kind of fun. Uh, okay, so since we have the assassin, we do not need... We can pick literally anything and not have to worry about positioning. Obviously, obviously, everything in my heart is saying the paladin... But I don't want to. Bring on the cleric. Bring on the cleric. Two potion slots. Elites always drop ancient items. Normal enemies can no longer be found in events. Elites and bosses have less HP. Sure. Okay. All right, all right, all right, all right. So whose active ability do we really care about? Honestly, I think it might just be the cleric. And then who's passive? It might be the assassin? Okay. That's, that's a no-brainer. We know that's happening. Hmm. Let's just think about this here. This is janky. This is janky is all get out. Um, freeze adjacent. Hmm. Oh boy. I think this is fine. I 
Uh, I think it'll be fine. I think it'll be fine. I want that back line dead, though. Obviously. That thing needs to go. And it is about to. Good stuff. Good stuff. Good stuff. Good stuff. Good stuff. We can't be healed by the cleric down here, but that's fine. Working out okay regardless. All right. Stop. <laughs> Stop. Stop giving me slightly upgraded soul slicers. Okay. Same story? Move all enemies. Wait. Hit them and an whoever's directly behind them. Move enemy away from their adjacent allies. Okay. Do we do that? This is all okay. Yeah, I don't love it. We need that backline thing dead. Like, it really is so annoying. I'm so glad we can poison it, even though it's not very logical to assume it would. Okay, there we go. This should start popping now. Good. Oh, that was close. We almost took a... A smack in there. Stun Barb is tempting. Because it is uh, an upgraded thing there. You know what? Yeah, we'll do that. I don't know. I'm, I, I, it's a, 7% is not nothing, but boy, it does not feel like it's worth going for. You're attacking him first. Okay. Is that fine? Do we want that? Or do we want to change it? Because we could do this too. But then we then he would get frozen. We're immune to burn, aren't we? Yep. That's really good. If your target was already burning, a pipe. Okay, I mean, that's so ideal. It's so funny. We can't, We literally can't be burned by you, you ding-dong. Really, the biggest problem is truly the fact that we cannot uh, be healed by the cleric by being up there. But he is tanky enough on his own between the arcane stabilizer and his innate passive that he is good enough to live on his own up there. All right, finally. Okay, 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 okie dokie, okie dokie. That is exactly what I was hoping for. Um, so, <laughs> wait. <laughs> eh. Calamity, we could put on Calamity up there. That's pretty weird, but hey, why not? I guess, right? We do the mass attack speed. We do something like that. Sure. God, it's weird. Okay. Super weird, but I think that that's right. I think that's the right-ish call. Okay. We should probably be putting on the Soul Slicer, I suppose. Oh, boy. Well, actually, that's kind of nice. Because he's actually going to get healed, right? Oh, my God. Okay, one's down. You're going to go down very shortly here. Yeah, the fight's going on long enough where we're actually possibly going to run out of that healing buff. Okay, we only lost one guy. That's really not that bad. Uh, that's not that bad at all. Woof. Woof-a-woof. 
What is what is Realm Tooth? Not quite. There, actually that'll work fine. That works okay. Uh, okay, well, let's get to a normal battle, and then we'll go into the ancient after. The, not the ancient, the elite after. I think this is okay, actually, just like this. Maybe we do it more like that. I mean, I don't... Do we want you to be attacked first, or do we want... Because we could do this, it wouldn't matter. Alright, we want we want to focus fire. We want to focus fire. We want to focus fire. This guy is bleeding. He's gonna die. He's so dead, dude. The reason I was okay with the bleeding, and I thought that it, maybe we could actually even win anyways, is genuinely just due to the Enchanter's Chainmail. Rank 2 being so good. It's like so good. Alright. Cool. I just, I just don't know about this move, actually. Like, I was excited about, or this move, this item. I was excited about it for a second, but I don't know. Okay. Can't be stunned. All right. <laughs> oh boy. Oh, this is this is not looking good. Yeah, he just attacks whoever the darn well he pleases, huh? Whoever he darn well pleases. That was some garbage. Yeah, that was... We just got some bad luck there. Uh, but, however... He was silenced. Oh, he's immune to silence. I bungled it. However... We won anyways. That's hilarious. That is hilarious. Oh my god. That is amazing. I genuinely cannot believe that. Holy moly. We got we got countered there. Pretty darn bad. All right, do we want to kill the backline? I don't think so. We want to make sure that we oof. Oof. Apply revenge to all enemies. So he's going to die if he doesn't have somebody protecting him. Does that matter? Nope. He's going to die. Or not. Okay, he's definitely going to die. Okay, we were able to kill those back lines. I thought that maybe there was a ch nah. What happened to your passive? Okay, well that sucked. But we can afford to be crazy due to the fact that... Um, Oh, wow. We have, like, 400 gold almost. Uh, we have 43 morale. It doesn't matter if we go down to one morale. You know, we have so, we have so many fights left ahead of us. It's okay if we need to take a, a few risks here and there, basically. Okay. We definitely... We do want to attack the back line here. All right.
You dirty fools. Oh, yeah, we're going to get our max HP reduced, which is actually really bad. I just can't. I can't kill that guy back there. Our damage is being split. It's okay. We, we're going to be fine? Question mark? No, we're dead. We're so dead. We're getting, like, really wrecked. Another... Uh, oh, wait. Our first Zephyr pendant. Okay. That's huge. That's really big. Oh, my God. That's actually really beneficial. I'm not using this. Um, okay. So... Bleh. What do we do here? We have so much information. We have so much information. Okay. What if... No. Let's just get... We, we want four upgrades. That's what we want to do. Those items. The items on my cleric are just so funny to me. They're not really cleric items, and I'm aware. We just need to live. We need we just need to live. Those are all good ways to help us live. I think that we even sell. Well, first, we can sell that 100%. We can sell this at this rate, and it doesn't really matter. Um, I'm not going to use that. Speed up. Boy. Oh, boy. All right. All right, all right, all right. All right, all right, all right. We got to get a potion maybe. Take the mana. It's a little little suspect. Do we have another shot before this? We do. Oh, we have another elite battle. That we're going to Oh, I don't think I've ever seen you before. Each time you 30% of your HP is lost, deal 100% damage to all enemies and stun them. Okay. Yikes. Uh remove a deal 150% more attack damage to your target. Remove a poison apply or remove a positive effect to apply poison. Every three seconds. Wow, that's a lot of damage. Okay. When they're defeated, any poison is then transferred. Are we immune to poison? We are immune to poison. You fool. You fool. You silly man. You silly man. You are absolutely... Hard countered. We might die anyways, but you are in theory. Oh, you, sir, I said you're hard countered, mister. Please listen to me. Please listen to me. I said you're hard countered. Okay, thank you. <laughs> okay. I kind of like the idea of. Re oh, boy, but we couldn't use Arcane Stabilizer. I like the idea of Realm Tooth and Saint's Vow the third. I wish we've been upgrading his passive, but we have not, so what are you gonna do? What you gonna do? Let's get Garot. Every boy, every girl, let's get the rot. Oh uh, Okay. Uh I'm going here for potions basically. For our boss fights. Zzz. We can sell that because that just doesn't do anything on the boss fight. That is just a true statement. 25, 25. Uh, 10 seconds he has to last for it to be a net gain. Oh boy, how I wish I was upgraded already. How much does it sell for? 20. Wait, does it not? What? 
If it's upgraded, I feel like it should sell for more, yeah? Hmm. <laughs> oh, this, these items are hilarious. What if... We did that instead. Okay. That's an idea. That's an idea. Yikes. We can then sell this. We can sell Calamity. My, I'm not using Calamity. What are we at? We're at six. 26. So there's no point to sell that. But there's also no point to have it. Is there another shop? Nope. All right. All right, let's fight. I say we rock the middle. Okay. Kill the back. Yeah, that's just so annoying. That is so annoying. God, I wish we had a backline slapper. Aside from you. Remove a random positive effect. Two targets. Okay. Win or lose, it doesn't really matter that much. You know, it's fine. Oh, no, please. Please kill this thing before we go below 35. Please kill it. Oh, thank God. All right. This is still really bad. Okay, you brought him back. You're just yanking him back and forth. All right. We're fine, ladies and gentlemen. This is bizarre. Okay. <laughs> this is... Oh, jeez. That was weird. Okay. Royal Arbalist is 100% worth having. You know, tis what tis. We're gonna... We're gonna get bodied. Uh, I know that the, we'll do extra damage to the shields, but it'll it'll still swap over. Yikes! Okay, I just want that backline boy dead, so we only have to deal with one of them. This is bad. Oh, God, here it comes. He stole my... Yeah, is this like, what am I supposed to do? He steals my shield, and then all of that? It's just too much. It's too much, man. That's way too much. Steals my shield. Reduces my defense by 30. Then deal... I get bursted by the... 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 the, the robo boy. I've never fought the Hydra. Okay, uh, oh, jeez, give me a second. And then, uh, and then it applies doom. That's way too much all, all in a one fight. That's way too much. Upon falling in battle, heal to max HP, remove all your status effects, reduce the number of effects your active ability applies. Okay, activates four times. Remove all your status effects. Ah, that's, that kind of counters our poison a little bit. The good news is that... We generally... Wait. Divided randomly among your target and any adjacent enemies. Do we seriously just do this, maybe? S 
Leech Poison. We're immune to Poison and Burn. That helps. All right, well, only way to do it is to do it, right? Okay. I was about to say, I was like, wow, look at that. We're wrecking. We can't be healed by the cleric directly is the biggest problem. But we might be able to heal off of Realm Tooth, which is the big thing. So one head's down. Two head's down. Okay, so we're starting to attack, like, really, really, really freaking fast here. Wait, why do you have Zephyr? I meant to give that to you. Why do you have Zephyr? I messed up there. We're fine. Like, we, we've won. We've won, but that's a pretty big whoopsie. Hydra is defeated. 100 piercing damage to all enemies every 8 seconds. Instead of being knocked out, heal 60% max HP. Remove all negative effects. Eh? Doesn't have any stats on it, though. Eh? Doesn't have any stats on it, though. You might as well take it. I'll take your dang bean. Sure. We might as well. Like, why wouldn't we? All right. So who do we upgrade the passive of? Probably the brawler. Right? Probably the brawler. Active. We upgrade. God, who cares? I kind of don't really care. I guess the brawler. <sighs> okay. Oops. What's going on here? Nope. Nope, nope, nope. That's what I want to do. Okay. So, hit your target and then directly behind him. I understand. Um, you're hidden. We can't hit the back line anyway, so Arbalist just doesn't matter. You apply the leech. What do you do? Reduce enemies max HP, apply shield. We definitely we have two po we should should use two potions. I guess cure all. And that I uh, no. Because we need we want a group heal. Alright. Okie dokie, let's see how this goes. Okay. Okay. Uh oh. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, I don't like it. Oh, I don't like it. Alright, well. Oh, oh, I don't like it. Okay, so. Okay, you're still alive. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. All right, 250. Assassin's gonna die, but that's okay. That's okay, that's okay. Because we're applying so many po stacks of poison. All right, we're alive, we're fine. We have, we got potions. We got potions to play with. And I genuinely think that this part of the fight should be easier. Uh, one HP is resolved. Your damage to all enemies, remove all shield, and two random positive effects from each enemy. I mean, there's not, you know, what am I going to do, right? I think that's the uh, correct play there. Okay, we're going to be fine. Okay, and then we do this right, right as he's gonna do this next one. 
Oh, this son of a gun is so toast, man. He's so toast. Oh, maybe not. Question mark? No, here we go. Rapid attack. Realm Tooth spam. That is gonna do it. It's too easy, dude. Buzz, buzz. What are you talking about? Phone? I just did it. That's right, I did it. Corruption 4 is unlocked. The Druid is unlocked. That's right, I did it. <laughs> oh, man. That was a good one. That was a very good run. And we have now unlocked two new characters. We unlocked both the Illusionist and the Druid. I may do a thing. I don't know. Maybe we'll... Maybe we'll try and do tomorrow's episode, like, kind of trying to focus uh, on using the Illusionist or maybe the Druid, one of the two. Gain 40 frail defense at the start of combat. Attackers grant you 3% speed until your frail defense expires. Weird. Okay. Heal the weakest adjacent hero for 15% max HP over 10 seconds. They gain four attack and one negate. All right, okay. Low key. Gaining negate is huge. 15%, 10%, wait. 15% max, okay, so it is a heal over time, but it's also attack and negate. Druid just seems kind of like, um, and he has a higher, much higher survivability stats and lower, like, lower mana requirement to cast the spell. Druid kind of just seems like I'm you but stronger to the cleric. But, you know, I could be wrong. That passive could add up to a pretty good amount of damage, but the Druid, I think the Druid just seems like I'm you, but stronger to the Cleric. We'll see. That is going to do it here for today, though. This has been Astro Arc. If you enjoyed the game, please pick it up with the link at the top of the description and like the video. Bing, bang, boom. Help out the, the whole <laughs> algorithm on the channel. A great deal keeping this series alive and well on the channel. If you want this series to stick around, seriously, hear me when I say liking and commenting on this video We'll keep this series around longer if enough people who hear this actually register that and then go and down, scroll down, and click the things. It will actually do a lot more uh, for the channel than just like, sitting there and hoping it continues, particularly. Uh, I also just realized upgrading item, upgraded items appear in rewards less often. That hardly seems like that big of an increase uh, by comparison. So... I'm so, yeah, we, we didn't have the option of doing this for the Bard. Uh, well, we did. We just failed. Whatever. You know. <laughs> but we can unlock the Bard tomorrow if we beat Corruption 4 anyways. Uh, 5, 7, defeat a boss with one hero remaining. You know. All right. Thank you for watching. Thank you, thank you. And I will see you next time. Bye.